Hello, and welcome to 3 Minutes with Kaijin, where you get quick answers to your specific questions in just 3 minutes. Today's question is, when should one use targeted sequencing? Let's ask Ryad Samara, Global Product Manager for NGS Technologies at Kaijin. Ryad? Thank you, Ali. Targeted sequencing should be used when one wants to achieve the following. First, focus sequencing capacity on certain genes of interest, which saves time and money. How does targeted sequencing save money and time? For example, if one is interested in identifying the role that certain BRCA1 mutations play in breast cancer, one can focus all the sequencing capacity on BRCA1 itself, without the need to sequence the entire genome. Second, do deep sequencing, which identifies low-frequency or rare mutations. Can you give us an example? For example, in cancer research. We now know that tumors are very heterogeneous samples, consisting of several cell types, which results in certain mutations being present in a very low number of cells relative to the entire population. The identification of these low-frequency or rare mutations can be achieved very efficiently by targeted sequencing. And third, increase depth of coverage, which increases confidence in sequencing results. How does greater coverage depth increase confidence? NGS has higher error rates compared to Sanger sequencing, so each base has to be sequenced many times in NGS, a parameter known as depth of coverage. The higher the depth of coverage, the more confident one is in sequencing results. This can be easily achieved with targeted sequencing. Fourth, sequence limited amounts of DNA starting material, such as from FFPE samples. Why is targeted sequencing so good for FFPE samples? FFPE samples usually yield very limited amounts of DNA and low-quality DNA, which limits their capability to be sequenced. Targeted sequencing, due to its lower requirement for DNA material, makes sequencing FFPE samples a possibility. For targeted sequencing, Kaijin has developed the GeneRead DNA-Seq targeted panels version 2. For example, the GeneRead DNA-Seq breast cancer panel allows you to focus on a number of genes that are known, based on current literature, to be altered in breast cancer instead of spending your sequencing efforts on the entire genome. For additional information, please listen to the NGS webinar series, which covers targeted sequencing and its application in translational and clinical research and NGS data analysis and interpretation.